it's raining. Oh, I hear it. I hear it. going on we had to actually get a new truck for well for multiple reasons we got to turn Sarah's car in this coming week or next week or it's actually not due for about a month we got that on the lease at the very beginning so we had to turn it in so I was like you know what instead of going out and buy a really expensive truck or vehicle I'm just gonna buy a truck that I can pull my boat with and I'm gonna give Sarah the white truck <laughs> coming into this week Sarah's had that car for probably three years or so just that three years but Sarah actually got in a fender bender which kind of sucks uh, a little bit because then we have to get the bumper fixed before we could turn it in because the car we lease but uh, this morning I got to pull up and I'm actually going to a, a quick little meeting for a project that myself and all the other guys have been working on for over a year now. And of course we brought Lake Fort guy in at the very beginning. He has been doing stuff with us for a very long time. I don't know if you guys really probably known that. We just never made it official till last week. We want to make sure we had all of our ducks in the row and we do and we're good to go. I'm pretty stoked. Hopefully unveil this project sometime soon. This is going to be one of those things where you just take the big thing and you kind of turn it in the, if you guys know what I mean, turn that pot, stop the turn. Don't know what I'm trying to say there. Oh, find your words. I'll show you guys the truck here later on. Came back to pick up Sarah and Avery because I'm going to take them along for me today. Avery, you ready? Oh, you need your bag. You need your bag. You need your bag. You want it? Okay. That's mommy's phone. She can't find it. Here you go. Let's go, Avery. Come on. Oh, you even found the pedals. Avery, you excited? You excited? This is your first time riding front facing in my truck. In any truck, actually. This is your first ready. time. We're ready! You're ready. This is so crazy. This is so crazy. Are you crazy? Yeah. Oh, you're I'm so crazy. crazy. You're so crazy. Ah. It's kind of warm out. So warm. We brought Sarah. Look at Sarah. She decided she's going to join us on today's adventures. We're going to go up to the land. we got to check out We're and ready. see if those trail We're cameras ready, are there. Yeah. You're ready. we got your boots on, Avery. Let's go. Let's go. You ready? Okay. Whee! You ready to get out? <laughs> okay. I know. Whee! Calm yourself. Calm Whee! yourself. <sighs> we had to come out to the landing. I want to show you guys see if there's anything. I know you're coming out. Calm down. Calm down. Avery is. Uh, she's excited. She's been in the truck for about an hour. <laughs> we were working on maybe I think it was yesterday no it was yesterday so I came back from Seattle the day before I'm like late in the night and then we decided you know what we had to do some house stuff so we met up our builder and we're getting very 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 close to being able to actually lay foundation and get it going they told me it would take about 120 to 160 days once we lay the foundation the rain last night it is going to be a mess all over Avery because I know she's gonna want to go play in the mud and the rocks which is good because that's what kids are supposed to do play in the woods oh, okay as I walk into the woods well, I'm going to go ahead and throw it out there. I can tell that something has been munching because you guys can look, look, all the leaves have been pushed around. That's good to see. I can tell. I wonder if it's pigs. How much we got left in here? It's pretty full. Okay. Got about a half left. Okay. That's what this sucker's for. Tell me there's something on this. Oh, 140%. There's been something walking back in here. Look at all of this. That's been knocked over here recently. Could be humans, but that'd be really, really weird. <sighs> And if it is humans, we got them on here. Let's 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 actually hope it's not humans. Okay, so I did I, I did just put most of it on there. Actually, not most of it. I did put all of the stuff that's on here. And I will say, I know for a fact that there is pigs. A couple different animals coming in, and I, I know for a fact that one of them is a big. He's got to be a boar by himself because he's always coming in alone and he's just doing his thing. I, I'll show you when I get down there. I think there's another camera I left here on the land. I think it's down by the pond. So I'm gonna go grab that one. I don't remember honestly. And then I'll show you guys Frank. Frank the tank. But I got the camera set back up, and uh, I mean they're they're coming all throughout here. You can you can tell something heavy was just standing here. I mean I know he's he's got to be somewhat pretty big, but he is coming all the way through here, and making his way to the pond, which we're gonna go to here in a second. Look at this! Look at what I just found. I'm telling you guys, I, I haven't walked too much on here. But if you guys want to know if you guys have pigs in your area, oh uh, this is pretty much it. And you guys see this clean tree walking along here? Oh, there's something broken right there where he's been walking. See all this mud that's just right in this area? He's rubbing up against it as he walks. You guys know what we do to pigs on this channel. I have not walked through any portion of this part of the pond as I'm walking up on it. I mean, it's clearly a trail coming through here. Oh. Okay, that's kind of neat. I got a camera somewhere over here. Man, looks like somebody who ever owned this before lied to some butt ice. Oh, another duck. 
Flair would be so happy. Oh. Haven't chucked on this one in a very long time, it seems like. Wouldn't it be kind of cool to see Avery catch her first bass out of this thing right here? That'd be really, really, really cool. Maybe it might be something that we put in there. And after, I don't know. I just think that would be kind of cool. Kind of a neat story. All right, I'm going to make my way back through, uh, back through this mess. <sighs> okay, here, here's the time that you guys may have clicked on this video for. Maybe, I don't, I don't know. We're about to find out because uh, here it is. Here, here she blows, ladies and gentlemen. I bought this truck from Demolition Ranch's dad. So it was his truck. He bought it back in 2006 and he's owned it. Oh, whoa, he's owned it up until right now. So as you can tell, hasn't really had anything done to it. Just the, the front bumper is it. The truck's got 170,000 uh, miles. It's just a 06 Lariat. Got a little bit of tears in the seats. It's just an old, it's an old work truck. Well, back in the day, it was probably top of the line, but now it's just pretty much, it's going to be my, my work truck. Uh, it's got the 6.0 in I know a lot of you guys are worried or I was actually somewhat worried if I, if I didn't know who, whose it was, I wouldn't have bought this truck. 6.0s have always worried me. I've owned a 7.3. I've owned a 6.0 and now I have a 6.7 and now I have another 6.0. Now I am going to be taking this in to get it checked up on uh, Tuesday, Tuesday. You know what, I haven't even looked at underneath the hood. We're gonna get, this thing's already had an EGR removed. Fully removed, completely. So we're good on that portion. Avery, you like the mud? Man, these airplanes are just up here just getting it, they. Oh wow, they really are, look at them. Look at that. He's stolen out on purpose. Why would you do that? He's upside down now. What is he doing? That guy's got bigger kahunas than I do. There's no way I'd want to do that. What the heck? I don't know. That was a trickster there. All right. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, so I have not looked underneath this hood one bit. So I'm going to the same time with you guys. And it looks like a Power Stroke V8 6L engine. That's what it looks like. Everything looks pretty clean. Uh, I wouldn't have, wouldn't have bought one of these if it wasn't from him because I trust him. If you can't trust a character, you can't trust anybody. Ain't that right? Smells glorious. Belts look, belts look tasty. You like the red truck? That's an airplane, yes. She named the airplane Clifford? Or she named the truck Clifford? Did she really? Oh, you told her. Oh. Clifford? <laughs> Clifford, okay. Well, I was going to go with old Frank the Tank, but Clifford is the name of the truck now, ladies and gentlemen. So other than that, the things that I'm thinking I got to get done right now, it already has that black bumper. I think I need to get this black bumper step side on the, you know, like right here. Clifford, yes. And then, of course, this needs to be done. I think Ryan would also agree with me on that. These guys are up here just getting it. He's upside down again. But I'm thinking about, I was originally going to put some sort of cap on the back of here, but I think I'm gonna get these things I saw. It's like a all metal tonneau cover thing that flips up like this so it can secure everything inside of here. And then I'm just gonna put bins for when I travel. This is pretty much gonna be the travel truck. And then uh, definitely, definitely needs new tires, like 100%. Shut it? No, I don't shut it yet. Uh, I have, I have, I've realized I've relied a lot on backup cameras and this thing of course does not have one. I went in to go take a look at one yesterday and they wanted a whole bunch of money for it. So I'm kind of like, mm, do I need it? Yeah, I probably do because I'll be driving alone a ton. But other than that, it looks pretty, oops, sorry sir. Looks pretty good on the inside. And right now it's filled with baby stuff and just spare stuff I threw over from the other truck. Other than that, that's, that. there she blows. Yeah, next thing on the list is drop it off. Gonna have them uh, shake it down to see exactly what needs to happen. Probably gonna bulletproof it no matter what since the EGR has already been removed, so that cut the cost already in half. So once you do that, these trucks will last for a million miles. Oh, 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 forgot. Uh, this, I'll come and leave it up to you guys. I'm gonna either stick a four inch or a five inch straight pipe from the exhaust. I'm thinking five since I already have a four on the other truck and this thing sounds beasty. You know what, let, let, let me just turn it on for you. Avery, you wanna turn on the truck? Wanna turn on Clifford? You want to turn it on? Here you go. <gasps> wow. I think she needs a new exhaust, right? It's yeah. kind of weak sounding. Yeah. I think she needs an exhaust. It sounds a little weak. Just imagine a straight pipe, four or five inch on this sucker. Just hear that sucky. Mm. All right. You want to get going? Okay. Big bass. Big bass. Big bass. Yes, big bass. Where's the duck? That's a duck, yes, that's a duck. Oh, it's Clifford. It's Clifford. Okay, let's make bets, Sarah. Let's make some bets. Milk. Milk? You said a whole bunch of milk. All right, how long do you think it's gonna take for her to go to sleep? 354. 354, I'm gonna say, I don't know, 10 minutes maybe, max, she'll be out. You gonna go to sleep? You tired? Yeah, okay. At least she admits it. Was it eight minutes? Was that eight minutes? Eight minutes. She's completely out. Done. Done ski. Not even ten minutes. Look at the lake. Look at the lake. Oh, it's so glorious. 
not really an absolute fan of the red in the green and black not really feeling it looked a lot better when it was my white truck that one that's right over there and the white uh, nah, I don't know Hmm. A lot of you guys are also probably wondering why would Sarah want to drive that right there. I'll tell you what, girls in Texas, they like trucks. She likes trucks, I promise you, when she is not. Not complaining that that's going to be her daily driver. She was either going to be that, or we have to get a loan on a 4Runner, or I could just give her that, and then buy this. It just made sense, you know? I mean, look at, God. Look at it, just, oh. It's all right, Clifford. You'll look good someday, buddy. Wow. So we came home and we decided, you know what, it's time to do a little bit of decluttering in this room and Sarah is going crazy. She's full of two giant trash bags full of stuff. I didn't realize I had this much bag. I know that Rackley and I have been discussing having like a uh, tackle giveaway, giving away a whole bunch of tackle and stuff like that. I've got a box set aside already. We're going to do that. So I'm trying to piece, piece together some stuff. But Rackley and I are going to be going fishing in the morning. I am freaking excited to get back out there. The weather's getting a lot better. We might be able to find some fish. We're going to hit a body of water tomorrow in Lake that I've never fished. We're going to go uh, two hours, three hours west of Fort Worth. Yeah, that's where we're going opposite. We like going east Texas. That is like Rackley and I's favorite place to go is east Texas. But right now I got to get this stuff done with Sarah. We gotta knock this out. Ain't that right, buddy? Someday. <laughs> He's gonna answer. But you guys know what to do. Click the video right there. If you don't see that one, then go ahead and click the one right below it and then go ahead and you know what you need to do is subscribe right down there. Do it, do it. Subscribe. subscribe. <laughs> I love you, Sarah. Thanks. Bye. 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 Bye.